sometimes you just have to treat yourself. Hi travellers, I'm Anne's daughter Lalika and welcome back to my channel. And the best part is, it's all over the Middle East in terms of delivery. Come in this ginormous plastic, which is actually sealed shut. So I have just come in and wash my hands and then all of this just goes straight out in the bin. I got some fruit too, which is good. And some cucumbers! I did this daily, which came in like half an hour. I have just come in and washed my hands before I touch my camera. Before I'm attacking them. Yes! So, this is free delivery, which is pretty great. Schwama, absolutely. This one I find quite cheap. There's delivery within 45 minutes, dinner today, lunch tomorrow, and there'll be leftovers there as well. So this is definitely more than one meal, which is what I try to do. Then it looks like I've got some credit. I didn't, I, I literally didn't know that. So I'm going to save that for next time. So you can see here, I believe you can pay foreign credit card. I have an account here so I can use KNET and of course cash. It's just so many different places. A lot of them are American, like old Johnny Rockets, Krispy Kreme, Cheesecake Factory, which I do love. Love their big salads. So many options. IHOP. Applebee's. So even for me, like I've only been to Applebee's once in Saudi, so I still don't really know what it is. Um, but it tells you here, like it's got live tracking, which I find good because sometimes the drivers do get lost. But yeah, it's very nice to choose the live tracking because then also there's a button where you can message the driver. So I've definitely messaged the driver going why are you not moving <laughs> like it's a bit creepy to be stalking the driver as they're forthcoming but it also gives me an idea of like oh how far away are they but at the moment because of the outbreak restrictions then i have to go downstairs to like the reception area of my apartment building if you haven't seen a tour of my apartment then please check it out the link is in the description box below I'm always with the free delivery because it's great and in case I feel like getting flowers in also possible I need some contact lenses I have ordered so like from some of these pharmacies it's great that they've got boots I'm also get electronics as well so if my phone charger goes down or I want to get I don't know what do I need here Oh look, gaming consoles, screen protectors, power banks, so like don't have to leave the house for anything, which is fantastic. I wish they had something like this in other places. The products are the exact same price as what they are in store because um been to Cheesecake Factory in store and yeah this slice of cheesecake is exactly the same price on the app as it is in store. So it's of no advantage to go unless I particularly felt like being served. And occasionally, they also, the this was free delivery, so I do actually get Cheesecake Factory when it's free delivery. <laughs> At the moment, I'm like, oh, 500, oh, yeah, nah. Knowing that there will come a time again where it will be free delivery, and then I will definitely order. And that's just me being cheap. Look, if I really felt like the salad then I would definitely order it. Like see how Kia 4 is like 90 minutes. Yeah I've never it's never taken 90 minutes. Uh, the other one that I quite like is the Sultan Center. Oh which is busy. So sometimes they are busy. 
and then you have to wait times restaurants or in this case a grocery store has a minimum spend if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing as i post new videos every week giving tips and strategies that may help enhance your travel experiences there's a bit of a think processing and order confirmation okay so keep the app open that's my other tip so that you can see as it's going. The front desk will call my room and say, your food's here. And so then I have to go down and get it. All right, and here it is. It comes with the receipt tacked on the outside, which is lovely. So, <laughs> I have no idea what that is. <laughs> Where's the hummus? Why wouldn't you do this? <laughs> Remember I also do order real food as well. The other alternative I just thought of while I was collecting my food was if you're a traveler and for some reason signing up to the app it doesn't work out you could always ask somebody at the front desk of wherever you're staying can you order me something on Taliban and do it through their account and you just give them the cash and that could be a way of how you could still utilize this. Sometimes you just have to treat yourself. This makes me look like I'm a pig. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty though. It is pretty impressive. I honestly have to say that one can order a cake and if I'd wanted it to say something on the base and you can totally do that within 45 minutes. Like that's pretty freaking great. Okay, so it's chocolate, vanilla and then red velvet with a cream cheese frost. They're real flowers because they've gone brown already. This was the cheapest one <laughs> because they're all the same flavor inside. So I'm like, who cares what it looks like on the outside? <laughs> anyway, just definitely another benefit of Talibat and should serve six to eight people. 